Furocoumarins are a class of defensive phytochemicals found in grapefruit. They comprise a furan ring fused with coumarin. They are a problem because in humans they affect the metabolism and bioavailability of a number of drugs. This has been called the grapefruit juice effect. Affected compounds include statins, benzodiazepines, oxycodone, cyclosporin, and others. The two most common furocoumarin compounds are angelicin and thorolin. From an analytical perspective, there are two significant points. First, as the graphic shows, they are structurally very similar. This means we need a highly selective discriminating HPLC phase. Second, these compounds have no ionizable groups, so separation should be able to be done with simple water organic mobile phases without the need for buffers. Upon method development, we found it was not possible to separate all five compounds in a single method on a C18 column. There was a coelution between the sorolin and xanthotoxin. So we tried an alternate selectivity phase, the Ascentis Express F5. This pentafluorophenyl propyl stationary phase is orthogonal to a C18 for many types of compounds. However, we still had coelution of sorolin and xanthotoxin. Changing the organic portion of the mobile phase from acetonitrile to methanol did not help so we ended up using two test mixes. This figure shows the major compounds, sorolin and angelicin. Note the simple water methanol mobile phase, the rapid analysis under two minutes, and the fact that the F5 and C18 gave elution order reversal. We have the same observation with the remaining three compounds, xanthotoxin, bergaptan, and isobergaptan. Simple mobile phase, very rapid separations on Ascentis Express, and dilution order reversal between the C18 and F5 phase chemistries. The F5 column gave longer retention as well as dilution order reversal for bergaptan and isobergaptan. Why is the ability to reverse dilution order useful? Primarily for trace analysis where you want the compounds in excess to elute after the trace level compounds. Using different phase chemistries is the most effective means to alter dilution order. We have provided this ability by offering a wide variety of Ascendus Express phase chemistries including C8, C18, phenylhexyl, F5, Hillock, Amid, with others currently in development. So how do Ascentis Express columns achieve high speed and high efficiency separations on any HPLC, UPLC, or UHPLC system? It's all about the structure of the particle, its unique solid core design. This slide shows what we mean by fused core. The drawing on the left is a cutaway of a fused core particle, and on the right is a standard, totally porous particle that has been used for HPLC since the 1970s. Note two significant points. First, the Ascentis Express particle is about the same size as a 3 micron totally porous particle, so it gives the same pressures roughly as a 3 micron particle. This has speed implications. You can run these columns at much higher flow rates on conventional instruments than you can run a sub 2 micron particle column. And if you have a UHPLC instrument, you can run it faster or use longer columns than you can if you had sub-2 micron particle columns. Secondly, the Ascentis Express particle has a 0.5 micron shell around a solid core. This has mass transfer implications. It allows faster mass transfer, a smaller C term in the Van Diemter equation, because the shorter 0.5 micron diffusion path into and out of the porous layer of the particle is about one-third that of the porous particle, so we can run at higher flow rates without loss of efficiency. There's another attribute not shown here. Fused core particles have a very tight particle size distribution, nearly monodisperse. This has A-term benefits. Although column efficiency is important, it's worth taking a few seconds to talk about selectivity to help explain the dramatic differences between the C18 and F5 column we just observed. This is the resolution equation. The graph plots the resolution versus the three different terms. Of the three parameters, selectivity has the greatest effect on resolution, and its effect does not limit as does the effect of efficiency and retention. Selectivity can be changed by changing the stationary phase, like we did in going from a C18 to the F5 phase, and also the mobile phase, but our experiments in changing mobile phase do not have the desired effect. Ascentis Express fused core columns are well known for providing very rapid, highly efficient separations on any HPLC or UHPLC system. The example shown here for phytochemicals from grapefruit juice demonstrated the power of bonded phase chemistry to separate closely related, structurally similar compounds. Ascentis Express C18 gave adequate separation of the compounds of interest, but an even better separation with increased resolution and selectivity was obtained with an Ascentis Express F5 phase, 
attesting to the greater flexibility of this unique pentafluorophenyl stationary phase. The C18F5 column combination provided a Lucian order reversal, an important benefit for trace analysis. 